Hello Internet, welcome to another Linux learning tutorial. Now, this tutorial uh, specifically uh, is a link between the usage of Linux and NS2 because um, a lot of times we we use GNU plot to uh, get the output of a particular parameter in NS2 uh, in Unix. So in this tutorial we'll learn how to install GNU plot. For that uh, you can visit the website gnuplot.sourceforge.net and uh, over there you can click the download from SourceForge and it's a 5.1 MB download tar file the installation is a little complicated so I'll guide you step by step as, as to how you can install it once the tar dot uh, gz file is downloaded you can extract it in a folder of your choice uh, for example I'll move this into my home folder and I'll extract it there If you go into the uh, download folder, you'll file the install and configure files there. So the first step is to go to the download folder. And then you could run dot slash configure. and it might just take a minute or so after that the next command is make so you could uh, it's a it's a three uh, step installation the first step is uh, dot slash configure which is present in the download directory and the second step is make it might just take a few minutes and now will do sudo make install it might ask you for the super user password if you're not logged in as a super user and finally the installation is done and if you click on gnu plot dot uh, dash help for help dot dash h you'll see all the options there for help and then in an example here I'll um, now this example I'm running it from Sigwin so you can simply type in GNU plot you get to the GNU plot command line and then you can plot any file for example in this case I'll plot a CBR underscore delay and output file created from an NS2 scenario so you'll need to learn the syntax but that's how the 
installation is done and the plot is going to look something like this and I hope this quick tutorial was helpful and uh, the installation is pretty easy and uh, you can further use this installation as a tool to get the output of NS2 files and as always thank you so much for watching the video and give peace a chance bye